SAT question of the day. For what value of n is the absolute value of n minus 1 plus 1 equal to 0? So let's plug in our answer choices and see what works. So let's start with a here. So if we plug in 0, we're going to get absolute value of negative 1. And that's just going to be 1 plus 1. That's going to be 2. Not equal to 0. So cross out a. Let's test b here. We know absolute value of 1 minus 1 is going to give us 0 plus 1 will give us 1. Cross out b. Then let's look at c here. We have absolute value of 2 minus 1, which is going to give us absolute value of 1, which is 1 plus 1, and that's going to give us 2, and so it's not 0. Cross out c. Therefore, we know that D is our final answer. And if we go back to the initial equation and just look at it, we know that because we have this negative 1 here, we are, and we have a plus 1 here, that ultimately, regardless of what we plug in here, we're never going to be able to get this equation to 0 because something positive or at most 0 is going to come out of this first piece of the equation and then you have a plus 1 here, so you're not going to end up with 0 to the equation. So you can either do a plug-in approach here, or you can just think through the structure of the equation.